Hi, my friends. I have a wonderful story for us today. It is called M is for Music. The author is Kathleen Krull. She's the one that wrote the story. The illustrator is Stacy Innerst. She's the one that takes the pictures or makes the pictures. M is for music. This is the title page. It's got all the publishing information on it. And the big title. Remember, title is just another way to say the name. And these are dedications. So people that meant a lot to the author and illustrator as they were writing and illustrating. And this is a musical stand. So when a, a musician gets ready to play, they put their music here so they can know. It's kind of like uh, instructions, so they know what notes to play. And these are famous quotes about music. So this one says, without music, life would be a mistake. Friedrich Nietzsche. Ooh, like the way I said that. Music is your own experience, your own thoughts, your wisdom. Charlie Parker. Helen Keller, let's see if I can get it in there. Hear the music of voices, the song of the bird, the mighty strains of an orchestra, as if you would be stricken deaf tomorrow. Helen Keller. That means to make sure that you know how important music is. And the last one says, without music, to decorate it. Time is just a bunch of boring production deadlines and dates by which bills must be paid. Frank Zappa. So these people were telling you how important music is to us humans. A is for anthem and accordion. Do you remember we talked about the accordion? And that one is Louis Armstrong. He was a very famous trumpet player. B is for the Beatles. They were a singing group. They sang pop music. C is for CDs full of carols and Cajun and country and western. D is for dancing and drumming all around your house. E is for Elvis and energy and encore. Encore, encore, encore means do it again, do it again. F is for finger snapping folk songs. G is for guitar. Look at all of those wonderful guitars. H is for harp. I is for interesting instrument. He's got cymbals here and he's playing a banjo and he's got a harmonica in his mouth and a big bass drum on his back. I'd say that's pretty interesting. J is for jazz. Oh, look at them. Look at all of those instruments. Oh, this one says kettle drum. Kick up your heels. Karaoke. Hey, we did karaoke. L is for loud. Look at that little girl. When in doubt, sing out loud. M is for music. Music teachers, where would we be without them? Mistakes. Everyone makes them. And Mozart makes you smarter. There's Mozart. Look at all the little kids singing. N is for Nutcracker. That's a famous play. O is for orchestra playing. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Remember that? P is for piano and practice, practice, practice. Q is for quartet and quintet. A 
quartet would have four people playing, and a quintet would have five people playing. R is for radio, playing reggae and ragtime and rock and roll. S is for street musicians, singing, show tunes, spirituals, and serenades. Aw, oh, look at his little dog. Yep. T is for trumpets, trombone, and tuba. Look at those guys playing. U is for ukulele in unison. Unison means together. So they're playing together. V is for voice and vibration. W is for whistling. Can you guys whistle? X is for experimental music on a xylophone. We talked about a xylophone. Y is for yodeling. Yankee doodle, yodeling. <laughs> Z is for zydeco. Woohoo! Zither and all forms of zippy music. <gasps> Look at that gator playing. Oh, I know he's dancing, right? Oh my goodness, the end. What a wonderful story. See you soon.